Tara, you, you're from Georgia. This team has never played Georgia before. Were you excited to see Georgia was your first round opponent? I was very excited to see that. You know, um, growing up, I did go to, you know, some Georgia games, watching softball there, and um, just seeing that name pop up on the screen, and you know, that's our first game. Um, I'm really excited. How far is Sylvania from Athens? Three hours, about three and a half. So, it, was it select trips uh, when you made the trek over there to watch games? Um, yes. Sometimes it would be with a travel ball team, or um, there was a girl that we knew. Um, me and my mom, we would go and watch her play. Um, yeah. Do you have any, any friends or former teammates on that Georgia team? Yes. But what was the overall reaction from the team? Going to a Durham Regional, you've played Duke this year, you've beaten them, and then you're playing an SEC team for the first time, and you've got to play every other SEC team in that league uh, since you've been here. Yeah, so just, um, you know, the predictions, they were saying, oh, yeah, we're going to Duke. Um, There's also Tennessee um, in the predictions, too, but those were our two ones that we were like, okay, um, we expect our name to pop up, and when it did, I mean, everybody was so excited. Like you said, we've already played Duke, and I think that we did really well against them this year. You know, we won, and just um, getting to get that rematch again, we hope to come out on top again. How do you think this team can use the experience from last year into this year. I'm sure you don't want to stay in the past, but I'm sure there's a lot of lessons you can learn that's helpful for you guys this year. There is a lot. Um, so just making sure that we're staying up and together as a team, making sure that we don't play down to an opponent, making sure we don't play up to an opponent, just making sure that we play Liberty softball. How does this solidify that, you know, again, back-to-back A's -back tournament champions, you're back at the tournament for the second straight year. How does it solidify the fact that, hey, Liberty softball is here to stay? Um, yeah, I just think that we're a very competitive team and that um, that shows on the field and that, you know, even if we're down, we find a way to fight and come back and um, win. So I think that we've done a really good job in the past and this year just with the girls coming out at practice and putting in a lot of work, I just think it's showing. Coach said earlier that in your losses this year, the energy's been pretty low and the wind has been pretty high. Um, the energy out there seemed like it was pretty high today. There was that one slide tag where the <laughs> hand came up and everyone kind of went crazy. Um, yeah. How do you feel like you guys can maybe harness that energy this weekend and, and use it to, to your benefit in the region? So I just think it's very important as a team that, you know, when we wake up that, all right, it's go time. Like, we need to make sure that we're all together, making sure that, you know, the little things, they matter, and making sure, you know, like you said, our team in the dugout, they're the ones that really get us going and, you know, kind of set the tone for us, and I think that's really important. What's it been like working with MC at center field this year and seeing her growth from never playing in the outfield before to being a former center fielder, working with her and constantly communicating with her about you know, how she can improve? It's been great. Um, coming in, you know, I I'm sure she was a little nervous, and you know, just me being able to help her and be by her side, knowing that I used to play there, giving her some tips. She's really, really fast, and she's just so um, open to any tips that I give her, and I just love working with her, and she's just a really good athlete. Did you think she almost, did you think for a moment there that she was bringing that one back there against you? Yes, I did. I did. She was beating herself up about it. And I said, listen, you did everything you could to bring that ball back. Don't beat yourself up. So she did a really great job with that play. And just, she's just an outstanding athlete. With all that you've accomplished here at Liberty, are you, are you letting yourself in, enjoy this run? How, how do you kind of feel about, I don't know, some of the, maybe the pressure, but also the excitement that comes with the playoffs? So I try not to think too much about it. You know, they say one pitch at a time, so that's kind of our main focus right now, especially for me. Um, I try not to think too much, just go out there and have fun. And, you know, like Coach Fagan says, the haze in the barn, we've prepared for this moment. And um, I just think that we're all ready, and we just have to trust that.